Well, we did mills and market to kind of focus uh, a point on the farmer. This is what the uh, whole event's about, is make sure that you support your farmer. The chefs there, Porto and Blue, they took the small farmer, took their product and showed how the moms, dads can go home and make a nice dinner. Part of farming is certainly being outside, growing things, and we love that. But uh, we also enjoy the interaction with the customer and letting them try the things that we grow. The goal really was to take the products that are available at the farmer's market on a regular basis and um, prepare them in a way that was very accessible to your average home cook. To give just little twists to the ingredients, but really to keep the vegetables honest. High quality food needs very little done to it. As long as you don't get in its way, oftentimes it performs great. And I think a lot of home cooks don't necessarily know that. They want to overcomplicate it. So hopefully we show them today that that is not necessary. On every postcard, there was a featured farmer on one side saying where you could find his or her products with Farmer's Market or CSA. And then there was also, on the flip side of it, a very user-friendly recipe using the products that the farmer was selling. I was really happy to be here today. Um, I think it gave uh, the people who are attending the Field of Greens a chance to put a face to the food. It's, it's what local food is really about, you know, the farmers growing the food that's presented here today. So I was really happy that, um, that the, the students got to, to work with it, but more so that the people uh, that came out today just for the food taste what good food really tastes like. Being a part of the Slow Food Convivian, we are ecstatic to be here, especially having the opportunity to interact with some of the farmers and learn firsthand about the vegetables. So for us, it was a wonderful day, just full of learning experiences. We were really glad to be here. I think it's really exciting right now to be a, a part of the farming community, particularly in Georgia. There's a lot of momentum. People are getting really excited. The more people that seem to know about it seem to want to be a part of it. So I feel like we're at the beginning of something that's really important, going back to where we should have been all along, probably.